Hi, and welcome to Goldstrom uh, in Edelfors, Sweden. Um, what you see here now is our African Queen, our new six-inch dredge. And uh, this one is made in aluminium and stainless. And today we're going to do a second test where we try this dredge. And uh, you are much welcome to follow us if you like. So, um, I want to show you the sluice box. Now we have taken off the sluice box and the ejector. It's quite easy, but it's because we are doing some maintenance. So, this is the sluice box. And the sluice box is made out of aluminium. And the ejector, which is here, is made out of stainless steel. And here we have put a rubber flap. And here is where the material is coming and um, I'm gonna show you these are the riffles we have made the Hungarian riffles and then we have a metal mesh under the metal mesh we have a miners moss and under the miners moss we have a rubber carpet so so this is we made it in in sections this is one of the sections when you like to empty the sluice. And then here is the miner's moss. Uh, so the material can pass through. And here is the rubber carpet. And these are also made in sections. So you can take them out. Pick up all the gold pieces. Put them in your pocket. And put it back. Simple and nice. Like this. So I wanted to show you the ejector. This here is the actual ejector. And then we have the flare which connects to the sluice box. And on this ejector we are having two inlets. One is there and one is there. And there is where the pressure water comes in. And then here is where we attach the suction hole. Here you see the ejector from now when it's uh, not attached to the dredge. So soon we're going to attach it. So now we are standing in front of the dredge. And these two are the pressure hoses coming from the water pumps on the engines, which we will have a look on too. And up here is the air tank for the divers. So with this air tank we can actually supply two divers down in the water. And it's having, it's a low pressure tank with eight bars pressure. So now we are standing inside the heart of the actual dredge. And what you can see here are the two uh, suction hoses. So here is where we suck up the water. And these are the... The, the bottom valves, these things here, let them go in the water and they will suck up water. And then the water goes here into the pumps. These are the pumps, two water pumps, which give 1,350 liters per minute. This is one and the other one is here. It's the second pump. And on this side, we also have the compressor. This is the air compressor, and it's a gassed compressor with the Teflon um, uh, cylinders. So it has two cylinders giving pressure here. So this is the side where we have the compressor. This is the air compressor, and this is the 10 horsepower, 7 kilowatt diesel engines. This is our trolley. We made it specially for this dredge. So a bit later on today you're going to follow us down to the water. We will put it in the water and then we're going to run it and you will see it in operation.
<laughs> jag tror det här är... Ja. <laughs> Så, jag är färdig Mats. Alltså... Är det bra det Mats? Åland som svårt eller? Är det kallt? Leif du får lär nästan komma ombord där med din mätare. Alltså det ska bli något nu. Okej okay, dad. Uh, so now we are in the water. And um, we're going to do some tests. We have uh, Leif, a guy from Perfecta, who is going to measure the suction on the pumps. And we have two divers today who are going to operate on the dredge. And um, we are on the Emo River in Vetlanda, Edelfors. Yep. 